By the way, good morning. Start of another new video. Don't ask why I'm using scissors to cut the string off bales. I can't find a knife. Simple as that. So, having to use scissors out the house, which is uh, great. There they are. String pile there. Right, that's what we're bedding. We've seen it all before. I think it's time to take these uh, pallet forks off. finished kicking it out that's really light stuff I have to say just end up throwing it round rather than kicking it right let's shut these gates bring these cows back in yes I don't know if you saw there the uh, new man is who driving past she is spotless literally I put some uh, mega cleaner on the wheels and it just lifted it off so well. I was so pleased, there's no marks anywhere. At the minute, until later. Here's our cows, just over there, ready to come in. So the class has gone this morning. Uh, when we were finishing off milking, it went. Came and picked it up, I think. So that's off to be fixed. And uh, should be back soon. I think it's getting a new clutch. Something like that, so they're gonna have to open it all up. Just to put a new clutch in. Ooh! Clean Manitou. Yes! Yes, yes, yes! We love a good clean manatee. So what we do is uh, scrape that out, scrape the collecting yard, then we just scrape the passage all the way through. So that's what I'll be doing next. And then we just scrape it into the muck pile and then eventually one day get spread. Don't know when that day will be, but uh, yeah. is now nice and clean so now I'm gonna quickly um, use some uh, Grassman green I think it's called and um, wipe down the dashboard and stuff of the old Manitou uh, I did the new one yesterday as you know I'll just tip this straw out sorry for the lighting in here it's those things in there when the sun's shining in that direction it's awful get blinded. Right, let's start wiping down. So why is 
Right, I've just done the dashboard. This just took me about five minutes, really. Um, I think I'll just brush the floor off as well. And then later on, I'll do the windows again because they're getting a bit dusty. Right, I'll put that blue so I'll back right. That's what I was using. See there? Yeah, grass men green. I was right. Uh, make sure it's just some stop there again. Um, right, if I get a brush and just brush the floor. This Manitou brush, and then uh, that's kept on top of. Just get that a brush as well. Just stop the straw building up and stuff, really. If you've ever wondered why the um, radio's out like that on this magnitude, it's because it uh, drains the battery. So when we leave it in and then come to it in the morning, battery's gone, so we just leave it out to be honest. Um, so that's why that's out. Now I'll tell you why I really like this uh, Grassman Green stuff. Did you see before how the dash was kind of like matte? It's not very shiny and stuff. Um, same with the wheel, but this um, Grassman Green makes it really shiny and gives it a really nice finish, which I really like. It feels nice as well. It's not sticky. It's a nice, um, nice feel. I wasn't uh, too keen on it first because it doesn't smell particularly nice. It's meant to smell like fresh cut grass, but uh, you can see where they're coming from, but it doesn't really smell like that. Just smells a bit chemically really and um, but it gives a really nice finish so i'm really impressed with it so far right on to some jobs right what i'm going to do now is uh clean the pile of walls just get a bucket out empty it and then uh, there's some disinfectant in this uh, thing here need that out and I need a uh, hypo in, which is this, just here. Hypochlorite. Just pump it in, put it on the pile of walls, let it soak for a little bit, and then go over with the um, pressure washer. Right, let's uh, make a start. There we go, I've only half filled it, so it's, uh, it's not too heavy. It can get quite heavy. There we go, oh, there's the Manitou. The Manitou. On the feeder. That's the dirty side of the feeder. <laughs> I cleaned half of it last night. Didn't do the full thing because it got dark, but now he's driving more around with a half clean feeder, which looks a bit silly, but. Anyways, yeah, half full. Otherwise it gets too heavy. Do half the wall at a time, I think. Hopefully you can hear me over that radio. Right, that's testing your memory of cartoons. Turn it down a little bit. Right, to get the pressure washer now. It's 
working. So we put it on there, warm. Just pull that there. Put it on warm. And hopefully it should bring the uh, stuff off quite nicely, he says. Fingers crossed. Right. One wall done. See it's come off quite well with the hypo. So it's done a nice job. Right onto the second half of the first wall, then there's another wall, another wall, then probably do around there on another day. Right. Second half. Right, that's one wall completely finished. Uh, what I'm gonna do, five minutes before I do the next one, is just um, give the Manitou's windows a wash while I've got five minutes. Otherwise it won't get done, and then they'll be done. And we've finished the windows. See, they're looking lovely. I'll just jump inside. I've also done like some, um, some of the panels and stuff with the, the green get that out I've sprayed some jelly bean stuff so it is smelling very nice <laughs> lovely indeed I think I'll end this video here thank you for watching I'll see you next time